Hello everyone. I am Mrs. Sunita Dor. The topic covered here is the construction of syntax tree. In the previous video, we consider dependency graph and the evaluation order. And now in this video, we are going to cover the construction of syntax tree, which is the condensed form of pass tree. Learning outcome. At the end of the session, students will be able to construct the syntax tree and the directed a cyclic graph for given expression. Syntax tree. Syntax directed definition can be used to specify the construction of syntax tree and other graphical representation. A syntax tree is a condensed form of pass tree useful for representing the programming language construct like expression and statements. Following diagram shows the pass tree and the syntax tree for the production S derives if expression then statement as statement. Consider the second example, A derives E plus T or T, T derives T star F or F, F derives ID or E. Figure 1 and 2 shows the pass tree and the syntax tree respectively for the expression A plus B into C. Leaf node for the operators and the keywords do not appear as leaves but rather are associated with the interior node that would be the parent of those leaves in the pass tree. So, internal node corresponding to an informative non-terminals are replaced by more meaningful operators. Syntax directed translation can be used on syntax tree as well as pass tree. Now consider construction of syntax tree for expression. The construction of syntax tree for an expression is similar to the translation of the expression into postfix form. We construct the subtree for the expression by creating a node for each operator and operand. The children of an operand are the roots of the node representing the sub expression constituting the operands of that operator. Each node in a syntax tree can be implemented as a record with several fields. So we use the following functions to create the nodes of the syntax tree for expression with the binary operators. Each function returns a pointer to newly created node. So we need some function to help us to build the syntax tree. So the first function is make node in parenthesis of comma left comma right. So this function construct an operator node with the label of and the two children left and right. Second function make leaf in parenthesis id comma entry. So this function construct a leaf node with the label id and a pointer to the symbol table entry. Third function make leaf in parenthesis num comma val. So this function construct a leaf node with the label num and the tokens numeric value val. Consider the example. The following sequence of function calls in figure 3 creates the syntax tree for the expression a minus 4 plus c as shown in figure 4. In this sequence, p1, p2, p3, p4 and p5 are pointers to the node and entry a and entry c are the pointers to the symbol table entries for identifiers a and c respectively. The tree is constructed bottom up. The function called MacLeaf in parenthesis id comma entry a and MacLeaf in parenthesis num comma 4 construct the leaves for a and 4. The pointer to these nodes are saved using p1 and p2. The call make node in parenthesis minus operator comma p1 comma p2 then construct the interior node with the leaves for A and 4 as children. After two more steps, P5 is left pointing to the root. So the sequence of functions are P1 equals to MacLeaf in parenthesis id comma entry A, P2 equals to MacLeaf in parenthesis num comma 4, P3 equals to MacNode in parenthesis minus operator comma P1 comma P2. P4 equals to MacLeaf in parenthesis id comma entry c and P5 
पी फाइव इक्वल्स टू मेकनोड इन पारंथसिस प्लस कॉमा पी थ्री कॉमा पी फोर कंसिडर द सेकेंड एग्जाम्पल द फॉलोइंग सिक्वेंस ऑफ फंक्शन कॉल्स इन फिगर फाइव क्रिएट्स द सेंटैक्स थ्री फॉर द एक्सप्रेशन ए इक्वल्स टू बी इंटू माइनस सी प्लस बी इंटू माइनस सी एज शोन इन फिगर सिक्स सो द सिक्वेंस ऑफ फंक्शन कॉल्स आर पी वन इक्वल्स टू मेकलीफ आई डी कॉमा एंट्री सी पी टू इक्वल्स टू मेकनोड इन पैरंथसिस यू माइनस कॉमा पी वन पी थ्री इक्वल्स टू मेकलीफ आई डी कॉमा एंट्री बी पी फाइव इज इक्वल टू मेकनोड इन पैरंथसिस मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑपरेटर कॉमा पी थ्री कॉमा पी टू पी सिक्स इज इक्वल टू मेकलीफ इन पैरंथसिस आई डी कॉमा एंट्री सी पी सेवन इक्वल्स टू मेकनोड इन पैरंथसिस यू माइनस कॉमा पी सिक्स P8 equals to MacLeaf in parenthesis ID comma entry P. P9 is equal to MacNode in parenthesis multiplication operator comma P8 comma P7. P10 equals to MacNode in parenthesis addition operator P5 comma P9. P11 equals to MacLeaf in parenthesis ID comma entry A. And P12 equals to MacNode in parenthesis assignment operator comma P11. comma p10 now consider a syntax directed definition for constructing the syntax tree following figure shows the s attributed definition for constructing a syntax tree for an expression containing the operator plus and the minus it uses the function macnod and the macleaf to construct the syntax tree the synthesis attribute nptr for e and t keeps track of the pointer written by the function call for the production e derives e1 plus t the associated semantic rule is e dot nptr equals to macnod in parenthesis addition operator comma e1 dot nptr comma t dot nptr for the production e derives e1 minus t the semantic rule is e dot nptr is equal to macnod in parenthesis Minus operator comma e one dot nptr comma t dot nptr for the production e derives t semantic rule is e dot nptr is equal to t dot nptr for the production t derives in parenthesis e the associated semantic rule is t dot nptr is equal to e dot nptr for the semant for the production t derives id the semantic rule is t dot nptr this is equals to macleaf in parenthesis id comma id dot entry and for the production t derives num the associated semantic rule is t dot nptr equals to macleaf in parenthesis num comma num dot val till now we consider the construction of syntax tree now pause this video and reflect on this question for a minute or 2 minute and write your response Once you have written the answer to this question then you can restart playing this video. Question is construct the syntax tree for the expression 3 plus 4 into 5. I hope all of you have completed this activity. The question was construct the syntax tree for the expression 3 plus 4 into 5. The following sequence of function calls in the figure eight creates the syntax tree for the expression three plus four into five as shown in figure seven. So the sequence of function calls are p one equals to macleaf in parenthesis num comma four, p two equals to macleaf in parenthesis num comma five, p three is equal to macnod in parenthesis multiplication operator comma p one comma p two. P4 equals to MacLeaf in parenthesis num comma three, and P5 equals to MacNode in parenthesis addition operator comma P3 comma P4. Directed a cyclic graph for expression. A directed a cyclic graph called a DAG for an expression identifies the common sub-expression in the expression, like a syntax tree. DAG has a node for every sub-expression of expression. Interior node represent an operator, and its children represent operands. The difference between the syntax tree and the DAG is that the node in the DAG representing the common sub-expression has more than one parent, 
and in syntax tree the common sub expression would be represented as duplicated sub tree the syntax tree for the expression a plus a into b minus c plus b minus c into d is shown on this slide the dag for the expression a plus a into b minus c plus b minus c into d is shown on the slide in the figure 9 in syntax tree as shown in figure 10 the leaf for a has two parents because a is a common to the two sub expression a and a into b minus c likewise both occurrence of the common sub expression b minus c are represented by the same node which also has two parents a dag is obtained if the function constructing a node first check to see whether an identical node already exist for example before constructing a new node with the label of and the field with the pointers to the left and right make node in parenthesis of comma left comma right can check whether such node has already been constructed if so make node in parenthesis of comma left comma right can return a pointer to previously constructed node the leaf constructing the function make leaf can behave in the same fashion the sequence of instruction in figure 11 construct the dag in the figure 12 provided make node and make leaf create new nodes only when necessary returning pointers to the existing node with the correct label and the children whenever possible till now we consider the directed a cyclic graph now pause this video and reflect on this question for a minute or two minute and write your response once you have written the answer to this question then you can restart playing this video the question is draw a directed a cyclic graph for the expression b into minus c plus b into minus c figure 13 and 14 shows the syntax tree and the directed a cyclic graph for the expression b into minus c plus b into minus c respectively while the figure 15 shows the sequence of function call for a dag so the sequence of function calls are P1 equals to MacLeaf in parenthesis ID comma B, P2 equals to MacLeaf in parenthesis ID comma C, P3 is equal to MacNode in parenthesis multiplication operator comma P1 comma P2, P4 equals to MacLeaf in parenthesis ID comma B, P5 is equal to MacLeaf in parenthesis ID comma C, P6 is equal to MacNode multi in parenthesis multiplication operator P4 comma P5. and p7 equals to make node in parenthesis plus operator comma p3 comma p6 this is the reference used for preparing this presentation thank you